Hi there, I'm Kieran Harris, founder and creative director here at Great British Tents. And the question we're starting to get asked as the nights draw in and the days get a little bit colder is, is it cold to stay in a bell tent? So we're here today to answer that question. Follow me. So we do everything in our power that you have the warmest, most comfortable sleep possible. So we do this by having nice high JB beds off the ground, keep you off the cold ground. We include a mattress topper, a bit more insulation, 13.5 tog duvet, brushed linen sheets. We even throw in a blanket to try and keep you as warm as possible. But what you need to remember is these bell tents offer zero, pretty much, insulation. So with the bell tent offering you pretty much zero insulation inside the tent, you need to remember that in the evenings, it will reflect the weather outside. So if it's 10 degrees outside, it's gonna feel like 10 degrees in the bell tent. If it's a lovely, glorious day during the day, it's probably gonna be a bit more toaster inside the bell tent. But here are a few top tips to remember when staying in the bell tent. So our first top tip is to exercise a little bit of common sense. If you're the kind of person that sleeps in your birthday suit, it will probably be worth bringing some pajamas to keep you warm during the night. For the last few years, we've set up a festival in the south of Wales and sort of during April and in the evenings, the temperature drops sort of below 10 degrees. So when we go away, we tend to pack um, some tracksuit bottoms and a hat to sleep in. And actually it's more than enough to sort of keep warm during the evening. So a little bit of common sense. If you think you're gonna be warm sleeping in your boxes, you're probably not going to be, certainly if it's in the latter part of the months. If you are staying in a bell tent during the earlier or later stages in the month and we have to be recommended earlier dressing appropriately, remember that it's better to layer up, it's better to have two or three layers of clothes on as opposed to one thick jumper. This will help keep the, the air in and warm up the air around you. Our next top tip is despite saying that the bell tent doesn't hold any of the heat in, it's always worth to make sure that you keep the port windows which are here, and the doors close during the day. This will help keep in as much warmth during the day and try, and try and help you keep a little bit warmer in the evening. Next top tip is if you are staying during the cooler months is why not bring a human water bottle with you? Nothing helps keep you nice and warm and having a nice little snuggle buddy. And our last and most important tip is if you are worried about staying in a bell tent during the colder months, maybe consider alternative accommodation. Staying in a bell tent isn't for everyone. So if you are that worried about being cold, maybe stay in a travel lodge. So in summary, we do as much as we can to keep you warm and as comfortable as possible here at Great British Tents. But when you are staying in a bell tent, we do ask maybe exercise a little bit of common sense and don't sleep naked, you're gonna be cold. If you are gonna dress, put some layers on to help you keep you warm. Nothing keeps you warmer than having a little buddy to snuggle up to. And if you are worried about staying in a bell tent and it being cold, stay somewhere else.